Hey guys, um, I'm sorry I haven't been up with a new review lately. Um, I wasn't exactly in my home. So, yep, catching back on, as you probably may have seen if you're any of my subscribers, which I'd like to thank, because I believe now I have 14, 14 like right now, and I'm very grateful for them all, so I love you all, my subscribers. Anyways, um... So as you saw, I have finished the Legacy of Bumblebee videos that I just wanted to do for absolutely no good reason. Ha ha ha. So now, unfortunate as it is, I have to go back to Cybertron and totally finish that off. So, finishing off uh, my smaller figures, here we have Transformer Cybertron Scattershock, his uh, first form. Here's a view of him. Uh, not much shows at the bottom. I guess that's a plus. You know, just the arms stuff. Yeah. As if you may have may not seen the show, Scattershock was a weak character. Never really liked him. And uh, I only got this as a Christmas present. whoop de doo And uh, he got, after he got his ass kicked by uh, Megatron, so did Hotshot and... Uh, Red Alert, they got reformatted it somehow, and he scanned this super cool Mega One. I love his, I love Scattershot's new form, but I don't have it. Too bad for me. Anyways, this is his car mode, as you can see, it's a tank type thing. Uh, I believe he did originally come with a handgun. It would fit in his hand and have two blasters sitting out the side. That would go right there, but I lost that. So in car mode, this does rotate. You can activate a cyber planet key, but I'm not going to. I'll just do it in robot mode. Uh, these are not trigger fire. They're, uh, you gotta push them. And they barely even fire at all. So, anyways, uh, before I get to transforming Scattershock, I have one little teensy weensy plane for him and his role and his uh jam mode. We have a uh, oopsie, Thundercracker. So a Thundercracker is much more larger, therefore he should be. La da 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 da. Scattered shock could get his ass kicked by anyone and or any who. So let's transform him, shall we? Very easy to me. Uh, the way I do it, just to get it out of the way, sort of back that up. Turn that around, pop it up. And then take this and unfold that and unfold that. Oh my god, it's a fork. Go down here, flip out the feet. Hold on, not enough lighting. So uh, I'm trying my best not to block. See, there we go. Flip out the feet. And fold those in like that. If there's high quality, I totally respect you guys that you would know to watch it like that. And uh, turn down the volume as well. So, and then stick your fingers in there and rip out his arms. Revealing his head. And what you're going to want to do is take this part and push it down like that. Take these up, and lock. Well, they don't lock. They just you know, kind of stay there. Just kind of make them stay there in place. Bend the arms. Turn his guns to face this way. And here we have. Uh, and then, of course, you know, turn this around. We have Cybertron Scattershock in his, you know, robot mode. Crap. Um, from my point of view, I honestly think he was a he was a Decepticon. Like, really? Come on, look, machine gun. Uh, I can't focus in that bad. I'm sorry, but machine gun, machine gun, giant rockets that you know do go up like that, which is good. A handheld gun, which two blasters on it, and cyber planet key power. 
fits in right there. Rockets. Honestly. And he, like, didn't even use this. I saw him use the rockets once in the show. That is too much weaponry for an Autobot. And especially Scattershot. Like, this nerd type person, I don't even think deserves this kind of weaponry. So, a Cyberclan, he does, you know, flip out all these uh, rockets. Actually, there's uh, 19 in total. 19 rockets in total. And yeah, sorry, I hit the camera. I apologize, my people. And of course, the Cyberclanic is an Earth. So I have, for size comparison, I actually do have uh, two robots. I have another minifigure. It's got a. Uh, ah, what's his face? Ransack. And uh, I can't just have small figures, right? I gotta have. I have red alert right there. Got a shock. And of course, you might have. I did red alert, right? No, I haven't done red alert. Have I done red alert? I honestly don't think I've done red alert. No, no, yeah, I, I've done red alert. Yeah, I, yeah, I, I did, I did a uh, Cybertron red alert. But anyways. Yeah, there's the size comparison. Uh, Red Alert is much bigger. But uh, Ransack is just a tad bit... No, 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 they're the same size. Yep, same size. What are you looking at? I don't know. What are you looking at? Kapow! So I bet everybody is probably wondering, where is his Autobot sign? Well, I'll give you, oopsie, I really did not mean to hit that camera, I am super sorry guys. Find it. Time's up. The answer is, his hand. Um, they actually did put detail into that to, to make a real Autobot sign. It's just because of my camera. Made it worse. You cannot see it. But that red dot is his Autobot sign. In the show, he'd have one on both hands, but they were too lazy. So that's Scattershock. I uh, hope you guys enjoy these reviews. I know one person does. He comments on every single video I got. I feel so proud of myself. Uh, one of... The and uh yeah i hopefully will will i hope this will be up soon and uh quick notice you guys have to see the transformers 2 trailer like the real trailer that was featured at the, the beginning of uh of the previews during friday the 13th omg like honestly it's a freaking good movie if you go to my channel and go to my favorites list, you should see it there. It's like a picture of Bumblebee half ripping through a thing. I don't know. Camaro Bumblebee. You have to see it. You have to. You have to see it. Ah. You have to see it, everybody. So, uh, goodbye. I'll see everybody later. Blackout? What? It's my shot, not yours. No, it's not. Blackout, leave. Fine, I'm leaving. Bye, everybody.